Grease is probably one of the most interesting and least understood products that the farmer will use on the farm today. It has the ability to lubricate in the vertical position, in the presence of water, in pins, bushings, bearings, a number of different areas where you just can't get an oil to work. Take for instance this tractor. You've got several different grease points where you need a product to go in, stay put, and to continue to lubricate no matter whether there's dirt present, water present, whatever, and grease can do that function. So grease has the ability to do all these wonderful things, but if you put two greases together that are not meant to be together, you can have issues that you were not expecting. If you get a product that is, say, lithium, and you put it with another product that is, say, calcium complex, those two products don't want to work together, and that incompatibility will actually cause issues within the equipment, metallic salts, and it'll plug up any of the areas where you think lubrication is actually happening, and it's not, you're starting to create wear. So you want to try and stay away from two incompatible products, because the result is definitely catastrophic. Most people will see a color, and they'll think that's their key understanding of what type of grease they should be using. Well, the color is nothing more than personal preference of the manufacturer, and they can put that color to any grease that they want. So a red grease from company A will not be the same as a red grease from company B. We realize that a lot of this information regarding grease may not be something that you have a lot of understanding or even interest in, but it is important. So we have put a grease compatibility chart on the back of our grease brochure. This compatibility chart gives you the ability to understand if two products are going to be able to work together. The top of the chart you have the names of the different thickeners, lithium, calcium, barium, polyurea, and then down the left-hand side of the chart, you'll have those same names. And the best way to read the chart is to grab one of the ones on the top that is the grease that you currently have in your equipment, go down to the place on the left where there's a grease that you're considering using, and see if in the box that corresponds with that chart, if it is actually compatible or not. If you see an eye, then you should not do anything because those two products will be incompatible. You see a B, that means there's borderline compatibility. That means there's some risk. And is that a risk you really are in a position to take? But if you see that C, like the C for Senex, then you know that you should use it because they are compatible and it's been tested to do so. At Senex.com, we have a variety of tools for you to get the information you need on all of our grease products. We have a grease usage chart, we have an equipment lookup tool to make sure you get the right greases. And finally, we have a Senex dealer locator on our website that helps you find the nearest location to get Senex grease and lubricant products for your farming operation.